Kamiya, in Japan's Wakayama Prefecture, is a large temple settlement home to over 100 Buddhist temples. The majority of the temples here practice a mysterious, esoteric form of Buddhism known as Shingon Mikyo, which translates as secret teachings. Shingon Mikyo is a school in the Vajrayana tradition of Buddhism, a tradition that is popular in Tibetan Buddhist teachings and is often referred to as Tantric Buddhism. Shingon Mikyo is one of the few surviving Vajrayana schools in East Asia. In the 9th century, the monk Kukai, also known as Kobo Daishi, established Mount Koya as the central hub of Shingon Mikyo. Since that time, over 100 temples have been established, and Mount Koya, or Koyasan as it is called by the locals, is a spiritual pilgrimage destination for monks and practitioners around the world. Mount Koya is home to the Okuno Inn Cemetery, a World Heritage Site that consists of thousands of graves and headstones spread through miles of old-growth forest. Here, the founding monk Kobo Daishi sits in his mausoleum, where believers of Shingon Mikyo claim he is not dead but is in eternal meditation, praying for the peace and well-being of the world. Shingon Mikyo is shrouded in mystery and is characterized by its secret teachings. To learn the secrets of Shingon Mikyo, practitioners must leave their homes, ordain as monks, and undergo an intensive period of training for 100 days. This period of training involves 20 hours of practice and only 4 hours of sleep each night for the whole 100 days. Many are unable to endure the challenging practice period, but those that persist through the entire 100 days are able to receive the secret teachings. I had the honor of staying at Yochi Inn, a Shingon Mikyo temple founded in the year 1109. Here, I learned about Shingon Mikyo, participated in their practice of Ajikan meditation, and had the privilege of interviewing the abbot of the temple. Um, the main purpose of Buddhism is I think becomes a Buddha. Um, in Japan, called Jōbutsu. Jōbutsu is a, becomes a Buddha. First monk is called Oshaka Sama Shaka, uh, Mr. Shaka. Is want to become the Buddha, and he practice and. He noticed that uh, all life and all things is a uh, Buddha, and all things is moving. So life is dead, and bird is dead, and the things is everything change. Rub is finish, and life is finish, and every moment is finish. Um, and uh, Mikyo is secret Buddhism, so the secret point is two secret points. Uh, first is uh, the teacher teach me about the secret point and he practice. It's a first, first secret point and Second is uh, we practice and uh, we we studied about the Buddhism and I notice the secret point is here. Oh, yes, this, this is two secret point and Mikyo's characteristic is uh, everyone can become the Buddha. Oh, this is. 
different point. Um, uh, than another Buddhism. <laughs> and in Japan, the, there is many kind of Buddhism. Uh, one is uh, our Mikkyo. And Mikkyo and another Buddhism, uh, after people died, the believer died, uh, they can't become the Buddha. So not Ari. So, but in Mikkyo, um, the Kōbōdai Shikūkai becomes a Buddha, uh, then he arrive. This is called Sokushin Jobs. Uh, they arrive and uh, he arrive and he enters the cemetery and he our teaching is he arrive now and he chant uh, for all life and all peaceful world. So, um, so we can we can become the Buddha uh, when we alive. This is uh, uh, Mikio's characteristic. The important point is. Uh, practice uh, and studied about Mikio's teaching we have to study it and we have to practice uh, uh, when we want to become the monk uh, in Mikio uh, we have to do the first tokudo uh, called shukke. Um, shukke is uh, go out of our uh, go out of our house, uh, go out of our families, and this is shukke. And we can get the monk's name, and we can get the teaching, first teaching, <laughs> and we cut our skin. And this is a tokudo. And we can we can get the our and uh, today is no clothes different clothes but we we have to um, put the uh, beautiful clothes uh, we can get this one and uh, second is uh, kegyo called uh, kegyo yes shido kegyo. And Keikyo is a practice time and uh, the Keikyo is separate for part. <laughs> um, I can't explain about the contents of Keikyo but um, the four part is uh, fast first part is we our practice is moving our body and play and uh, play is so playing so the playing is so hard so our school is uh, decide age and uh, most youngest youngest is uh, 15 years to 45 because over 45 years is uh, can't can't do practice because it's very hard and fast playing fast uh, part is uh, moving body and praying <laughs> um, this is very hard and second, third, the last is uh, a different playing, not moving body. We sit the chair and we do uh, uh, another practice. 
not not moving body uh, we uh, we we make our mind and doing yes doing practice and the time is so tight uh, the most strict most strict day most strict weeks uh, we can we, we have to wake up at midnight 0 a.m. and um, very tight and 2 a.m. the first practice is start and about 4 hour or 5 hours we practice and after practice is morning ceremony and doing morning ceremony and clean clean the hall and clean the school and eat breakfast maybe uh, 8 9 9 a.m. and maybe 5 hours playing and 2 p.m. Uh, eat lunch maybe 50 minutes and we play again five hours maybe 7 p.m. and uh, we do evening ceremony 30 minutes and 7 30 and we eat the dinner maybe 10 minutes and so 8 of 8 p.m. and we we prepare tomorrow's playing so we we must sleep nine because the school's uh, right is turn off all turn off so 9 p.m we can sleep and tomorrow midnight or 11 p.m we have to wake up uh, this is very tight time and um, many people um, break their body yes and many people retired in the practice yes we must do the four part and the four practice finished uh, we can get the teaching uh, this is a secret point we can get the teaching and Mikyo's Saho Mikyo's uh, Mikyo's culture is very secret point so we want to know about the secret and the practice finish um, teacher teach me yeah, about the secret point and we can do all uh, things about Mikyo mm. the um, our meditation is is many meditations but uh, yesterday's Ajikan meditation is the most different and yeah, the most difficult meditations and, uh, Ajikan meditation's purpose is become the Buddha mm. when we meditate when we are meditation. So this is very difficult uh, for normal people, and we we can't do we can't do this. But um, I think. Uh, I don't know. In Mikyo, all, all of, all of that in this world is uh, Buddha. So, uh, of course, 
the this is a Buddha and this crosses is a Buddha and air and our voice is a Buddha so our Ajika meditation leads so we can get the Buddha in our body and Buddha clean our body and go out so this is most important point of our Ajikan we can get and the Buddha clean our body and this time we can become the Buddha so when you when you breathe in it cleans and when you breathe out yes and the bliss is the please imagine bliss the first bliss is uh, beautiful air and go out is uh, old and bad emotions go out and our bodies purify and yes um, three part is ajikan first is make make the position and make our bodies and second is um, control the breathing and last is um, control emotion and control mind and the last is very difficult because another place if you go um, you you hear many voice and many sound so our mind is not strong so you get the another sound oh. so you your emotion is moving so um, so control mind is very difficult and um, please thinking please think about the uh, aji a uh, word um, for example I I love her I like I like you but the emotion is moving and all in this world all things is finished so you you your sink is called obsession um, is so bad things I think and, and um, and uh, please please nothing <laughs> it's too difficult in English mm. please be careful for other people um, because Mm. Sorry, <laughs> I can't okay. explain. <laughs> That's okay. I'm so sorry. So it sounds like you're saying like, don't obsess yes. over things. Yes. Like, yes. Um, maybe instead like, calm your mind. Yes, yes, yes. Of course, calm your mind. Okay, great. Thank okay. you so much. While Shingo and Mikyo keeps its secret teachings reserved for devout practitioners, there are certain teachings of Mikyo that are available to everyday people. Shingo and Mikyo teaches that everything is made of the same energy, that while things appear to be different and complex, they all have Buddha nature as their source. A Buddha is one who realizes this unity, and in doing so, frees their mind from all suffering. Practitioners of Mikyo believe that everyone can become a Buddha in this lifetime if they devote their lives to practice. While many practices remain private for the monks, 
The practice of Ajikan meditation is considered to be one of the highest teachings and is available for anyone to learn and practice. The meditation involves breathing in and visualizing the in-breath as a purifying mist that cleanses the body, and breathing out, visualizing the out-breath as all of the negative and harmful energy that we may have within us. Through continued practice, we invite in all the positive and holy qualities of the Buddha, and we release all of the negative and harmful qualities born from ignorance. Eventually, this allows one to embody the qualities of a Buddha and to wake up to the Buddha nature in oneself and in all things. Whether one is interested in learning about Shingon Mikyo, wants to see ancient temples and historic sites, or wants to experience the beauty of nature and learn about the rich cultural heritage of Japan, Mount Koya is a beautiful destination to visit and is a place where one can experience deep inner peace, incredible outer beauty, and a unique glimpse into the ancient history of Japanese Buddhism.